Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Destiny and I'm going to do a bread up unboxing, which I haven't done for a little while, maybe a month-ish. And this is 10 pairs of kids shoes. Now, probably wouldn't recommend this box for everyone, but I have four kids, so surely I can find something they can wear. If not, I can take them to Once Upon a Child or list them or just donate them. This box for 10 pairs, I think is $34 plus tax and shipping so yeah let's just jump in here my oldest is a girl she is six and then the rest are boys four two almost five and three their birthdays are both in july and then i have a two month old so these are cat and jack from target oh this box it's not that big but um it came from pennsylvania I actually ordered it a week ago today. Today Sunday. So, it did take a little bit to get here. I got here yesterday. But, okay. Anyway, these are from Target. Cat and Jack. And they are size 1. Which is my daughter's size. So, I will see if she wants these. These look like something she would like. Just sparkly sandals. Next, we have some little boots that look new. Size 7. The other one's trapped here. There we go. These are Beverly Hills Polo Club, which I don't think is anything too expensive. But I live in Tennessee and we don't get a lot of snow and these are actually too small for my older boys and too big for the baby. So I will just list these, I think. I'll look up comps. If they're not great, I'll just take them to once upon a child. I need to go by there and get some baby clothes. Anyway, all right, next, these are from Jimboree. Little girl shoes. Actually, I'll just leave them together. They're really cute, though. They're little flats. Or, well, not really a flat. A little wedge. And they are... I think someone cut out the tags. Yeah, so I won't be able to tell what size they are, unfortunately. So I'll just also take these to Once Upon a Child. I think they'll take them anyway. They're cute. They look like maybe, maybe a 7 or 8. These are nice. They are Adidas. And they still have it. They have a tag on them, but they don't look new. So I don't know what that's about. They do have some, they're not like super dirty or anything, but you can tell they've been worn up close. And these are a youth or a men's four and a half. So like a women's, I think it's like a six and a half ish, six. And they have the 11222 on here. I don't know anything about sneakers, so I'll have to do some research on this. And, cool. I'll look up some comps on these and I'll let you guys know on the screen, hopefully. All right, next, we have some Mitzi Tootsie flats. These are a size six. So these are more like a women's but these are going to be a donate I think it might be from the rubber band but the black like leather right here is starting to flake off so I don't really think that's wearable like that so I'll just I mean it's probably wearable but I'll donate them so I've got two for once upon a child one to list and one to give my daughter and one to donate Okay, these look like Birkenstock knockoffs. They're size three. They're just from Children's Place. I think I might go ahead and list these or take them to Once Upon a Child. So this box, I may make my money back on. I may not, we'll see. All right, Cat and Jack, size 10. These are my younger middle son's size. I might have him try on. He has very thick feet. I don't know if, if your kids have this, you know, it's like their foot is as thick as it is wide. And I can't get any shoes on him half the time because his feet are just so chubby. And they're not that long, but they're really tall. So I usually have to get stuff with adjustable straps and things. So like I said, these are his size. They're size 10, just from Target, but they're pretty cute. And he could use a pair of sneakers like that. Alright, got some more. This is a 
The rest are sneakers, just so you know. All right, these are US Polo Association, and these are seven and a half. So, um, yeah, I don't know that these are kids. They're not a bad style. So see, I'm a seven and a half. So yeah, they're definitely a women's seven and a half. They're kind of cute though. I might keep those. I mean, cute enough that I could wear them. I'm hoping to start, like I said, I'm about, I'm almost three weeks post, or three weeks, almost three months postpartum. I've been cleared by my doctor, you know, to work out or whatever. So I'm going to try to start doing that with my mom and I can always use sneakers around. I'm trying to get back into my 10,000 steps a day, but I haven't got there yet. It's not always doable with a baby. I did order a carrier, like a baby carrier that I'm really excited about. So let's hope that helps me get some more steps in too. All right, so these are a US size four youth. So like a woman six-ish Adidas pink. Um, it says gazelle on the side. I've sold this model before in not great condition for I think 25 or $30. Got a huge dog hair in there. Um, it's got a little bit of pet hair. I'll just take my lint roller and get a little bit out. Little mark there. I'll definitely list these. Hopefully 25-ish. We'll see. Alright, last pair. Another Target pair. Cat and Jack. Girl size 4. These are cute. So I will, I think I'll probably, I don't know, with Target shoes, I could try to list them now and then I don't know when I'll get to Once Upon a Child. Maybe I could go tomorrow. Anyway, um, I don't know when I'll get to go out. So either I'll list them and then keep them listed until I go to Once Upon a Child if they haven't had any action or I will just go ahead and take them on once upon a child. I don't know yet. These look in great condition. Maybe I'll look up the style. They don't look like they've been worn that much. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We have our 10 pairs. I'm going to list two for sure. Keep two for my kids. Keep one for me. Got one to donate. So, so I'm going to take once upon a child. This box, like I said, is not great for anyone who doesn't have their own kids or doesn't want to go to buy, sell, trade. I did, I have before gotten some really cool Nikes. I think the only other time I ordered this box and they paid for the box and more, but obviously this time this wasn't the case. Unless those Adidas are worth, like these Adidas are worth something. But anyway, that's our box for this time. The baby's crying, so I'm going to head out of here and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.